Ultimate Town Sandbox has added a bunch of new things, so let's get right into it. First off, the hunting camera introduced a new weapon, the M1 Garand, as well as a hunting rifle. The M1 Garand is kind of overpowered, being a one-shot headshot, and the hunting rifle is also kind of overpowered. Next up, crouching. For now, it's not that useful, but it's a good way to not get shot. Also, enemies will always crouch when they're reloading. Next up, we got codes. There's one here, another one here, another one here, and we don't know what the last two are. Here are all the codes, and I'll explain them all to you right now. Lava King can be found here and gives you $707. Give me $5 gives you, well, $5. Jacob's the best gives you $500. Code literally gives you a single cent, and its location isn't exactly known today. The code Mr. Beast, however, no, it's actually the same thing. It gives you $5. To redeem your codes, you need to go to your inventory, statistics, and it's gonna be right there. And you know what? Let's do something. By the end of this video, I'll teach you a code that doesn't even exist in the game and gives you $1,000 instantly. And next up, we got trainer changes. Don't alert NPCs basically doesn't alert them when you should near them. Police ignore basically makes the police ignore you if you rob something. No recoil is pretty self-explanatory. And the lightning bolt is literally the best feature in the entire game. You can now change the weather however you want. And that's pretty much it for the trainer. But yeah, they also changed the assault rifle. Looks way cooler now. And they also made smoke look way cooler for guns. And there isn't really anything else, so let's get into the details. First off, there might be a new character, which is the shopkeeper guy. Anyways, the code here is UTS code 1. It gives you a free $1,000. Uh, cool, I'm gonna go see 